In today's session, I decided to train my arms. It's been a while since I trained biceps. I actually injured or strained my forearm a couple of weeks ago, so I've really been able to train them. And so today's the first day back. I started with concentration curls. The goal was 15 reps. The weight wasn't very heavy. The goal was just to get some bicep work in. So I chose 22 pounds and just curled away for two sets of 15. It was great to be able to do curls again. It's been a long time. So I'm grinding out those reps right there. I'm getting tired. Then I prepared myself for barbell curls. Since the concentration curls worked out okay, it was time to do some barbell curls. So I loaded up the barbell. Again, I did uh, two sets of 15 with the same weight. And what I was doing this time is I was actually trying to raise the weight up pretty fast and let it down slow, working on the negative. I actually like to train this way sometime because it doesn't work. I don't feel like I'm working my tendons. I can actually feel like I'm working the actual muscle. In fact, I never do barbell curls really heavy because of that reason. Afterwards, it was time to return to dumbbell hammer curls to work on building those forearms up. So I did two sets of 15. Again, the pace on these was slow and actually paused at the top, flexed real hard, and then lowered it for all sets. I would consider this a good bicep training session. Seriously, the weights weren't so heavy. I could probably do this training session again tomorrow. Who knows? Maybe I will. Then it was time to move on to triceps. I decided to do tricep extensions. And since I've been doing 15 reps, why not continue? As you can see, I'm doing for my forehead back. I don't like to do these with very heavy weight because they do irritate my elbow. So I used a light weight and just cranked out the reps. And then it was time to work my triceps using an overhead tricep movement. So I chose to use chains. That's three sets of chains right there. One thing I like about chains is they deload on the bottom and fully load at the top. So I cranked out two sets of 15 with that. This also helps if you have a, something to hold the weight when you get it in position. Uh, I was gonna do it without, without an apparatus holding it. I really couldn't figure out how to do it without using my calf machine. Then I moved on to dumbbell side laterals, the leaning variation. I decided to do these because I didn't do any really shoulder work this week. So I figured this would be a good opportunity to train some shoulders. Thank you for watching. I appreciate it.